And you've seen probably about as much as this as I have now. I mean, maybe not as many times, but... Alright, I gotta remember the controls. I think I put the tapes away, the ones we did. Well, let's see. I'm holding on to the tapes that we didn't finish. And we can try those later. Um, so, before we do Dolores, I'm actually going to see if I can find the Coco stuff, just in case it is buggy. Um, so, I don't know why. I was looking in all the wrong places yesterday. Um, I am not turning up the brightness. You can deal with it just the way I am dealing with it. It's perfectly bright in here. Alright, apparently it these bottom cabinets open. Um... Ah! Uh, <laughs> hot chocolate, okay. Why did I not look down there? <laughs> Why does that not look like me? Because I'm not wearing a, a Korean schoolgirl outfit? Alright, milk. I think I said milk and I didn't even look for the milk. Okay. Whoa, the fridge just magically shut. Alright, um... I don't know, my hair is not that straight either, so that, that picture is not gonna... That picture is not gonna help. Alright, so I think you guys gotta put it on this. <laughs> okay, the cup is empty, how sad. I like the little commentary here. Uh, I think that's it. Let's see. How does this work? Oh, I just clipped in the microwave. That's... Oh, I was probably supposed to do that first. the radio turns on yeah I know that hot chocolate's like a must in this case <laughs> I don't know what it's been about the house lately the house is like really angry at me all the time all right <laughs> okay Okay, so Coco is gone. Alright. Alright, we gotta go find the Coco. And I know where it is, so. You. Bad radio. <laughs> oh, wait, why are the lights off? Oh, come on, game. Okay. Uh, do I have to go around the house and turn all the lights back on again? Yeah, I know. It takes my lighters. I actually, I stocked up on lighters and light bulbs because it keeps popping lights too. And I remember that happened a lot to me the last time I played this. Um, oh. Oh, there it is. Can you see it? The bedroom is green. <laughs> hey, Matryoshka doll. I just noticed that. Yeah, those spots are getting bigger. I don't know, like... What do you guys think? Is that normal? <laughs> I want the Matryoshka doll. Grace! I didn't know if you would pop in. Oh, of course, the clock's going off, too. Alright. So, we drank the cocoa. I'm probably gonna die here. So, where's the doll? I just saw the doll was there. Oh, it's hidden. Okay. Yeah, who would ever find that? Okay. Lights. I want lights. I'm gonna turn on the lights before we do Dolores. Um, okay. 
Oh! Oh my god, okay. Alright. Okay, yeah. He's he's active. Okay, I'm uh, getting out of here. Okay, he's right there. <laughs> okay, that's bad. <laughs> we didn't trigger him at all last time. He's here now. Oh, he's right on my butt, too. Oh, this is bad. Oh, okay, that got me. That, uh... Yeah, okay, so that's what happens when you see those blotches on the wall and they get big enough. They start to... Things come out of them. Okay, I'm... See? They're, uh... They're kind of taking over. Alright. Hey, it's gone. Alright, you can see the prints, too. Now remember we did see those before yesterday. I don't remember what we what we were doing. Yeah, no molded yet. I so I wonder um the black spot's gone. I'm wondering if spawning that um <laughs> no grace, you can't. <laughs> you you can imply it. Um I'm wondering if spawning him Oh, come on. Radio, right? Really? Wait, why is the light off again? Corey! <laughs> okay, I'm thinking that if the if the black spots on the wall um, trigger uh, trigger him to come and get rid of those and, and disappear, maybe I don't know if that's a glitch, but maybe I can actually get rid of him. I swear they didn't disappear in my last game though. Or maybe uh, the spots come back and I just haven't got to that point yet. Um, so, in case, um, I know Cor uh, Corey, Caitlin, Sacred, you're all familiar with this game a little bit. I have the brightness turned down. Oh, yeah, that's getting big. Abby! <laughs> I have the brightness turned down um, quite a bit because I was really stupid when I first played this. And I didn't realize that there were two little icons that you had to adjust. And so I adjusted it so the brightness was, like, uh, basically, basically as far down as it could possibly go. Um... And so what that what happened is it actually made the the gamma looks really bad if you increase it. So I just kind of left it that way. Um, and so you're actually seeing this game really really dark right now, and I actually think it looks really good myself. But um, uh, Firebird, remind me to check the telephone later too. Okay, uh, I gotta do lights. Okay, lights, lights first, then we'll start the chapter. Okay. Uh, I don't know, are the lights that important at this point? I don't want to go in the basement. <laughs> okay, this light was bugging out on us last time. Yeah, it's still not working. Okay. Um, so I was also going to say um, for uh, Sacred Corey Caitlin that um, you know how there's... Oh, what was that? Wait, is that not working? Um, if you're familiar with the sanity meter in this game, I actually have it deactivated. Okay, yeah, okay. I'm getting out of the dark. So I can't actually tell if I'm losing my sanity right now other than the game telling me that. Um... I think I may have burnt out a light there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and fix it. <laughs> oh, this is bad. Okay. Um, this is really dark to me. I don't remember this area being that dark. Yeah, I was gonna turn the sanity meter back on, and then I decided no, I'm just gonna suffer with it. And if I die, I die. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now our, our lovely friend from the wall, I believe has a name, I'm not going to say anything because I haven't had it confirmed for me in game yet. Oh, can I work on you? Um, but you know, we'll see, we'll probably see that later. Um, oh yeah, no Jack in this game. Honestly, um, 
If you see, you see the way I'm walking right now, this is his run. This is him running. Okay, I gotta remember how to get back upstairs now. Alright, let's uh, start off the chapter. Some nightmare fuel. Yeah, I know. Like, okay, let's see. Okay, see, the black spots disappeared. <laughs> no, bad. Okay, the black spots disappear when you're in between, when you're in chapters. So, um, I don't have to deal with that. Of course, now I gotta deal with Dolores. So, a mirror key for the mirror door. Alright. Yeah, good luck with that, Grace. Half the time I'm not going to know when they're coming up, and you're probably going to hear me panic. This game uh, is terrifying. Oh, why are the lights off again? No. No, no. No. Oh, fine. Oh, oh god, that pulled my, that pulled me, um, pulled my camera. I did not do that. Okay, alright, I'm stuck, alright. No! Stop! The house is already taunting me. Okay, lights, on, wait, oh, the lamp. Alright. Okay, lights back on. Light switch simulator. Okay. <laughs> the the mirror seems to show a room in the house. Now, if you haven't played this before, you've been all over the house by now. Most like oh, they did it again. It keeps pulling my attention. Um, if you have played through this already up to where we are, you've probably seen most of the house, and that does not look like any room in the house. Um, and that's because the game's giving you a hint. There's somebody in the attic, you need to go into the attic. I don't... I don't remember this chapter being particularly hard to follow at the beginning, but I know that uh, Steven used to get really confused on it, it seems, so I know where to go, but um, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to know where to go quite yet. I just know where it, where it is. Alright. Uh, I think I hear something rocking. Alright, so that's the rocking chair from the mirror. I feel like I should probably ditch some of these light bulbs. But I know this... Ah! Okay, I forgot about that. <laughs> hey there. I'd like the lights back on, please. I, how many times have I watched people play this and done it myself and oh my god, why are the lights all off? Okay, no. No, no, no. Are you kidding me? It's not letting me turn the lights on. It's making me walk around in the dark. Oh, come on. That's gotta be a glitch. It's not supposed to stay off. Yeah, we do know who this. I know who this is. Um, at least I'm pretty sure. Okay, before I do this, I want to see if Rose has left a message. Okay, so she hasn't left me a message. I know she does.
Oh, the lighter's empty. Great. Okay, so it does direct you right to the room. Okay, there's some different things here that I don't remember seeing. Those lights should not stay off, and that light was not flickering the last time I played this. And I'm pretty sure who you were just seeing is the guy in the photo, which is Dolores' husband, I think. So, Dolores on the left, George on the right. I should have my lights back now, <laughs> I hope. Oh, the lights are back. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait. I don't have my lighter. Crap. Okay. I might need to go find some more lighters. Um, okay, I was going to think, where do I have to go? And I just remembered I got the hook for the attic. <laughs> don't go in that room. <laughs> we all saw what happened last time we tried that. <laughs> Alright. Light. Why is that light not on? Is that... Oh! No, 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 no. No. Alright, um... The light's not broken. I don't know what turns... Oh, there's a, literally a switch right there. Okay. Alright. Oh, hey, there's a lamp back here. More lamp. More light. Okay. Oh, you can hear me scream, Grace. I did yesterday. Uh, right, upstairs. Oh, yeah, the house is making sound. I better move my butt here. Alright. You know, as much of a pain in the butt as this chapter is, I have to say it's probably my favorite just for the amount of scares they throw at you and how well designed they are. Okay, weird music. Let's move. Alright, rocking chair. So this is what the mirror was showing up. Oh! Oh yeah, that scared me. Okay. Alright, sun and tea are written on the box. We have to open that later. Firebird, remind me I gotta come up here later. You want me to stream White Day? Would anybody want to watch that? Seriously? I would love to stream White, White Day. As long as I'm not streaming Hell Mode. Alright, music box. Okay, first tape. We gotta listen to the tapes. These are important. Yeah, I would love White White Day is awesome. Okay. Um, so before I leave this room, let's listen to the tape, because I know where this is. Oh, I think I actually might have to listen to the tape. Um, no, no hell mode. No, 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 no. Alright, alright, alright. Let's uh, put the cassette in. Dolores' symptoms are aggravating. Doctors tell me it's become very hard to pinpoint the exact disorder. They tell me she's got symptoms of schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, psychosis, dementia, and more. I don't know what to do anymore. It feels like the treatments are only making things worse. Today she told me she often hears her own voice whispering a sequence of five numbers through the baby monitor. She said it's the key to her inner house. What does that even mean? What am I supposed to do? Okay, so that's the five numbers he's mentioning. It's 50373. I think 73. <laughs> Actually, um, I was going to make Caitlyn a mod too if she didn't mind. Sacred, you can jump on that too if you want. I just, I had some random people pop in here yesterday and I, it got me worried. So, I don't want 
my account getting attacked by YouTube for inappropriate things. Um, all right, so the tapes, there's four tapes. You can see them in the slot here. Um, and that's the last, of one of the last tapes, I think. That's the fourth tape. So, um, um, so for tapes, uh, basically it's giving you some history on um, George and Dolores, the main characters of this story. Okay. <laughs> Give them the jersey biz. All right. So puzzle is pretty simple. Put the put the slipper here. Here the mirror. Close. Disappear. All right. Y'all ready for some nightmare fuel? Because this is gonna get bad. Door is open. Wait, can I do the? So these pictures pop up in the last chapter. I just noticed that when we were playing yesterday. Um, so you got the one with the hood with where you can't see the face. We got the one that looks like it's been shot through the head. And then you got the one that looks like it took somebody's face. Um, God, she's everywhere. Ah, uh, that laugh. Oh my gosh, she's in the floor. That laugh gets me. Oh hey, something new. All right, so we're back in the regular house. Uh, there's blood on the floor. Okay, we gotta follow the blood. Um, yeah, just blood. You know, let's uh, shut this room. I don't want to go in there. We all know what happens in that room. We'll try it later if somebody wants to see it. Oh, the house is getting angry. I'm moving. I can hear the house cr <laughs> creaking. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> Smokers line in insanity. Yeah. Yeah, that's about it. Oh yeah, what <laughs> my progress room. Um Oh the house is making sounds. Alright, so Y'all remember the guy that just popped out of the walls and um oh my god I can't see anything. Oh my god, I cannot see anything. <laughs> <laughs> Am I climbing a ladder or something? Or oh no, I'm on the entrails. Okay, I'm climbing the entrails or umbilical cord or whatever it is. Um, so if you remember the guy that walked out of the walls, watch ahead. Now remember when I went back and looked where he was, he came out of the black goo from the walls. He left black footprints, like tar or oil or something, and that body there looked like what? Oh man, that body looked like um, that body looked like uh, looked like a guy covered in oil, if you ask me. Um, so this um, Firebird, I commented yesterday how the there's that scene with the cabinet in the darkness. This is that's my second favorite. This is by far my favorite. Look at that. That is just beautiful. That's just like nightmare fuel. Like there's just nothing but abyss in the mirrors.
It's worth watching. I know what's gonna happen and I'm at the edge of my seat just as well. I knew that was coming, so that one didn't get me. I, I still kind of flinched, but... I think you have to go around. I'm pretty sure you have to. Oh, it's still not lighting my lighter. Okay, well... Bring me my child. Okay, so this is where the house is going to change, I think. Um, I, may, I don't think there's anything else I have to do. So this room was not here before. There was a couch here earlier. Alright, <clears throat> this is where things get really confusing. So, oh, there we go. You know what, while I'm here, but sometimes there's lighters in this room. Alright, well, I don't see any. I don't think. Oh, there's light bulbs. Okay. Okay, let's, uh... Get the alarm off first, that's annoying. Alright. Let's uh, get this. There's a part of me that's tempted to break all the mirrors first, but at the same time I feel like I should go and check out the rooms, because I know I'm going to forget them all anyway. And I'm not going to know which is which. <laughs> Caitlin, I just saw that message. I'm <laughs> he braced himself for that. <laughs> I'm kind of wondering how many people actually jumped at that because I, I knew it was coming. That mirror, that mirror part. Oh, I didn't... That's new. I don't remember that. I don't remember hearing a mirror. Oh, wait. No, open. Let me out. <laughs> okay, I just clipped through a car door. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, my, what? I am literally stuck. I can't move. Uh, <laughs> I can't move. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, oh, wait. Uh, am I stuck to, like, the mallet or something? Okay, uh. <laughs> okay, I think I, I broke something. <laughs> I'm gonna die here if I just get stuck here. You know, um, as much as bugs in games are annoying sometimes, the bugs in this are actually pretty interesting. <laughs> I remember on like the early access version of this, you could find like random pill bottles and lighters just floating in the air. <laughs> yeah, let's not get stuck this time. Now it's an interesting chapter because this is one of those chapters where you think that Dolores is kind of your main antagonist in this, so to speak. Not antagonist, but she's your main um, scare point. <laughs> yeah, Steven really breaks this game all the time.
So there are other um, there are other characters in this besides Dolores that can hurt you, and I'm gonna show you one of them because I think it's really cool, and it really caught me off guard the first time I did it. Yeah, you see the breaking sound. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. It just says move to stand up. Oh, okay. All right, all right. I am out of the car. I am out of the car. Aha! All right. You know what? Let's save now that we're out of the car. So we don't have to do that again. All right. That glass breaking. Oh, that one automatically breaks. Okay. Okay. So that All right, so this is the this is the way this chapter works for anybody that has not seen this before. You have to use the mirrors to navigate the puzzles in this house right now. The house is not the same as it's always been. So if you see a mirror, you have to use the mallet to smash it, but besides that one. That one that just smashed itself is access to the different parts of the house that are blocked off to us now, because if you noticed, um, I walked by a door earlier that had... Oh, really? Hey. Alright, meet Dolores. Oh, okay, sanity's decreasing. Let's get out of here. Oh, there it is, right behind me. Um, so that's the door. Uh, that's the way the doors in the house are blocked off now. So we can't go through those anymore. Uh, but we can use that mirror right here to navigate the house. So just got to remember that's there. I'm going to let her stay there so she doesn't appear elsewhere for now. Um, all right, let's get let's let's go break some mirrors. The drywall area. I'll show the drywall area when we're done with the the chapter. Oh, oh my god. The house is making noise. What is going on? Don't tell me the house is already aggroed at me. Yeah, I'll show them the drywall um, later on. I think I need to put this down for this. No, not... There we go. Okay, so this puzzle we can't do right now. Something about balls and a vice. That sounds dirty, but it's not. So there's a puzzle where you can rotate the plates. You can open the windows. Yeah, the house does not like me, especially this time. And uh, you can adjust the clocks. I said not dirty. All right, let's find more mirrors. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the how I'm going to start getting haunted by her now. <laughs> oh, that's where she was appearing earlier. That's the stairs. I think there's a, a mirror up here. All right, nightmare fuel. Okay. I said balls in a vice. The baby is holding a ball. Okay, we got the ball. Now let's put the ball in a vice. Literally. Okay, puzzle solved. Okay, I did not close that. <laughs> Alright. Let's get rid of this thing. Remind me to save too. Um, okay. The fact that she's actively out is terrifying. Alright. Come on. How do I do this? Okay. Alright, see we got the ball in the vise. I told you it wasn't dirty. Oh, I'm not in the dark. There's light everywhere. Literally. I gotta, I gotta move. That's gonna come back to bite me. Okay. All right. Oh, I can't save. She's active somewhere nearby. <laughs> she up here? No. She's somewhere that's not let. Oh, I can save. All right. Let's save. Let's save. That's a good idea. All right. Oh, the house is making noise again. All right. Let's not stand around here. 
Okay, so the mirror I smashed first, that's where that, that piece of paper goes to. Alright, here we are. So, I think that's what the paper's for. Alright, come on. How do, oh, examine, okay. Alright. Wow, I can totally not read that. Alright. Is that 3 o'clock? 3, 3.30. Um, and... Is that six and let me see. Oh, anyway. Okay, I uh, I, <laughs> I can't logic right now. Um, let me see that again. No, no, don't put it away. No, come on. No, no, stop. All right, there we go. All right, all right, all right. Small hand. I think I have to rotate. I think I read that correctly. Uh, yeah, I'm hoping. Uh, you can't do it during a chapter. Uh, I think that was right, right? Uh, it's going to turn it past me, isn't it? I think I did that right. Aha, okay. It's really weird. Um, I always struggled with math my entire life. And uh, for some reason, old clocks throw me off sometimes. Alright. So, faces... Faces are pointing inward, looks like. Okay. Oh, I remember this now. Okay. Um, I can't believe these are so close to each other, and I always, like, forget that. Okay, so... Middle one is closed, right, left and right are open. All right. All right, we did it. Uh, okay, door is gone. Baby is crying. I'm just walking in circles. <clears throat> or squares, I guess. I don't honestly remember if I have to turn around or anything. There we are. God. What is wrong with this place? I need both hands? Why? That better not take away my mallet. If it takes away the mallet, I gotta go down to the basement to get it back. I really don't want to go down to the basement. Give me that back. Okay. Okay. Um, how do I get out of here now? I can't see anything. Oh, there we go. Let's get out of here. We're done with this place. Alright. Puzzle solved, partly. Can I store this? I don't know. <coughs> um, oh, okay. Bad. Haunting. Okay. All right, so um, the baby monitor. Oh, hey, uh, are you being a little twitchy over there? Okay, I'll go this way. Wait, can I go this way? She's being a little bit twitchy over there. Yeah, the birds are crowing. <laughs> 
I think the radio or the okay she's gone oh I forgot that one was blocked off um wait I thought the front door was open for a second okay she's gone I think you have to go to the bedroom to do this one So that's the set of numbers she was repeating. Now I'm going to try something. I used to try. She's doing it to me already. Oh my God. I didn't even get the words out. She used to do that to me every time I would save my game. Go away. Go away. I want to save my game. Watch. Wow, she'll do it again. You. Oh my God. Stop. Go away. No, I don't have your freaking baby. All right, I'm saving here then. She's just going to troll me. She did that to me like four or five times in a row last time. All right, so baby monitor. Um, you have to hear the numbers from the baby monitor um, because everywhere she scribbles, they're overlapped. And I don't remember where to go for that one. So I, I don't know if we need the baby monitor for the next part, but I'll hold on to it just in case. I wonder if I can store it. I can. <clears throat> yeah, she does like to troll. Actually, I'm going to switch this with the lighter. Alright. Let's, uh... I think that's George's study. I can't do anything in there yet. Um, there's one in here. Let's, uh... Let's open that. All right, let's uh, put you down. I'm not sure if this is the one, I think this is where the puzzle goes. The, the one I just did. <laughs> what? what do you mean no, oh see, baby monitor, that's it. Okay. I think you have to follow the time as five. All right, so that one's five o'clock. Zero, so 12 o'clock, midnight. Three, right there. You know, these puzzles go a lot faster when you know what you're doing. Uh, oh. Does that count as three? Oh no, seven. Seven. Duh. There we are. <laughs> I can't math. <laughs> Alright. Three. I don't know why I don't... I don't remember this one. Oh, this one. Uh, possible epilepsy warning. <laughs> don't touch that. I think this glitches out on different systems, not the P, uh, PS4. Alright. It's very fleshy.
right. <laughs> uh, this is kind of gross. I don't know if there's anything in here that can hurt you or not. I don't remember ever getting hurt here, but... Uh, the kitchen has seen better days. Uh, I can't see a thing. Can I use this? Okay, thank you. Alright. There we are. The gramophone should be here. Trails or umbilical cord. That's lovely. Why is the basement light? Why are the basement lights off? Okay, let's follow the entrails. Uh, what was that? <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. What? Come on, open, open. Let's get out of here. Okay, all right, there we go. I don't remember what the phonograph handle is for. I think that's for when you get, maybe when you get the record later. I think once you get the record at the end, you use that handle. All right. Um, so there should be more entrails to follow. That <laughs> things I thought I would never say. All right, there we go. Okay, I think this is where she gets her baby. Okay. Um, uh, you know what? I don't need that anymore. I'm going to leave you here. <coughs> leave me alone. No, no door. I have a baby. You can't do anything to me now. Oh, I need to drop the freaking mallet. Great. So now the mallet's going to be stuck in the basement again, and i got to go back down there. Ah, uh, yeah. That's not a baby. That's a... That's something else. Yeah, I know. Took my hammer away. That's kind of pretty here. Can we just stay here and enjoy this? It's very light. I like it. Alright. That should be the first piece of the true puzzle here. There we go. <coughs> Alright, so that is our first true puzzle piece here. The toys. There's five of them and we got one of five. So we what do we do? Just solve like four or five different puzzles for that one piece? 
And now I lost my mallet. And I'm down to three lighters? Great. Yeah, this is... We're batting a thousand. And why is that door closed again? Oh! Got Dolores in here. Doing her thing in the corner. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna leave you there. It's just the new resident. The crazy one. Yeah, he's nuts. Always on drugs and alcohol. Don't mind him. He's probably out of it anyway. Everyone who lives here is fucked up anyway. Fuck him. <coughs> Let's move on. Did you see what the batshit crazy old bitch did yesterday? Oh, I know, I know. I've seen her. Oh, shut up, you cancer-breathing microwave. No one wants to hear it from you or your toasted brain. Hey, watch it with the toasting remark. Anyway, I hear she's been walking around the house completely naked, like a fucking whore! Are <laughs> 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 you kidding me? What the hell's wrong with this old thing? Yeah, it does remind me of Brave Little Toaster. I'm trying to get some sleep here. Oh, boo-hoo! Big guy needs his sleep. By the way, you guys have been repeating the same walking around naked semi-joke for months now. I have some real news for you guys. Oh yeah? What's that, you twat? You're stuck with me. Don't you remember? I think if you'd had some news, I'd have heard it along with you. Yeah, right. You're sleeping 16 hours a day. My sources whisper me some great stuff. Your source is my ass. You're talking about that broom. You can't trust a broom, I tell you. Oh, quit your whining, big guy. Let us hear about the news. I heard. And saddle up. It's big news. I heard that the old woman murdered her husband in cold blood. <gasps> Not only that, but I heard that she plunged seven knives in his chest and that he's sitting dead in his study room. How crazy is that? As crazy as talking in kitchen appliances. <laughs> Yeah, so that's a thing. <laughs> the birds didn't like that. All right. Yeah, so uh, there's a lot of stuff. I mean, that's kind of weird. Um, but there's a lot of stuff said in that short bit there. It's important. Come on, lights on. All right. So first of all, first thing she said about me was, or one of them said about me, is that I'm probably on drugs and alcohol reinforcing my earlier thoughts and statements yesterday about the fact that Dwayne's uh, an addict and which we've seen a lot of evidence of that with the beer cans and the pills all over the place speaking of pills they're all over the place beer cans all over the place um, so some backstory on our buddy that we're playing as here also um, who is it? Hey, Dolores. Yeah, I see you out there. I can't get out of the house. Yeah, I know you're there. Alright. So the other two things they mentioned that are kind of significant. Would you stop haunting me? Uh, the other two things they said that are significant uh, was one about how she's walking around naked all the time. Uh, something she does do, and you can run into that. <clears throat> and about her killing her husband. Which we'll find out <laughs> soon. Alright, so this is how this is the first window that broke on its own. This is how you get to the other side of the house. I really didn't want to come in here, but I need the mallet back, so... I'm going to head back to the upstairs first and finish that, or at least do what I can up there. And then uh, we'll come back down here.
there's actually some really interesting stuff too that there's like little easter eggs in this game that are kind of fun to find and one of them's in this chapter well I don't know if it's an easter egg but it's interesting not as interesting as the uh, um, the uh, hot chocolate thing Lights, please. Lights. Thank you. All the lights. Uh, wait, where is my storage room? I can't remember. Where the, is that in here? Or... I think I'd have this place figured out by now. Why is it so dark here? Jeez. Lights, come on. Oh, here we are. Alright. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> you don't need to tell me that. Okay. Alright, come on. Let's uh, do a quick save for prosperity. Want to be able to come back to this? Alright. I think we go back this way. Jump through the hole. <clears throat> Alright, let's get the rest of those mirrors upstairs. see which mirrors I'm missing. I know I didn't do the study yet. That door is always closed every time I come up here. <laughs> hey, I'll just leave you there. You don't need to move. That's your room. You know, let's not even go over there. Let's just leave her alone. Hey, Dolores. Okay, I don't think there's any mirrors in here. There are some upstairs, though. Got the bathroom. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh uh. No, no. Where's my lighter? Stop. Okay, I'm gonna break open the study. Um, I don't remember if there's anything in there I can use right now. Hey, Maddie. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't think that was a mistake. <laughs> oh, the infusion bag. That's what was up here. All right. So when the, when the uh, kitchen appliances were talking, and let's not let's not overlook the fact that kitchen appliances were talking. Um, they said that she stabbed her husband in his study, and uh, you can see that there are six knives and one that has been pulled out. <laughs> so uh, so yeah, that's a thing. So we will come back here. We got the infusion bag. Alright. You know what? I didn't check Lucy's room. I don't think there's anything in here, but... No. Why would there be? Ah, where'd my lighter go? Okay. Alright. Okay, stop. I think that's it. I think that's all the mirrors on this side of the house. Let's do one quick sweep before I head downstairs. Firebird, if you're uh, if you think of any that I may have overlooked, let me know. Oh wait, there might be. Oh, you know what? There's one. Okay, 
I did miss one. Oh yeah, let's do this one. Okay. Uh, let's yeah, let's do this one. This one's kind of creepy. I am going to save. And it's a good chance I could die here. She's right behind you. <laughs> so if she does catch up to you there, she will kill you. Oh, this puzzle is so messed up. This room is terrifying. Alright, I need a lighter for this. I think I can get more lighters in here. Um, okay, alright, let's uh... Let's uh, check this out. Alright. Gotta remember to pick up that lighter. Let's see, come on. There we go. Oh, uh, let's see, whirling... Whirling? In an everlasting dream. A two-sided moon with a cl cloud of vision lies down innocently by its guilty shadow. Um, so that's a, it's a, this is kind of a riddle. You have to raise the bodies of the, of the three of these that match the two-sided moon, cloud of vision, and guilty shadow. Um, I think I need the crank for this part, and I think it's, might be upstairs. And I think I need that for the next place, t too. I'm gonna go and look for that really quick. Well, and then we'll come. Wow, the brightness settings are not helping here. <laughs> this place is really dark. <laughs> All right, there it is. All right, so we can raise those bodies up in the light. Hey, Firebird. I thought you were still there. Sorry. <laughs> so I was modless again. Thank you. All right. Um, All right. So uh, if you missed out, I went through that. Um, the last mirror upstairs, the one that brings you through the hole in the floor where Dolores tries to kill you. Oh, yeah, you did say that. Um, so I gotta find a moon, something for vision, and a shadow. Um, let's see. I think I'm safe here. I'm not sure, though. Alright, stop spinning. Oh my god, I'm stuck. <laughs> oh, I'm standing on bodies, never mind. <laughs> All right, never mind. There we go. All right, all right. So an eye, that's one. Okay, so it's left of the central thing. All right, let's uh, let me go do that one quick. Oh, you're good, Firebird. You're good. I I don't think there's a lot of lawlessness in this in this chat. <laughs> I actually don't even know who's still here, because the numbers on my screen don't really depict who's actually here. So, I don't know. Alright, let's uh, let's get this done. So, I think that's the right one. I think that was the eye. So, that would be the clouded vision. <laughs> oh, I just realized my lighter is out. <laughs> You know, I don't know if I really need it. I can see a little better with that out now. All right, so make sure let's make sure I got the right one. Yeah, okay, the eye. All right, you know what? Let's uh, let's take this. And uh, I got room, so let's take a candle. That's not a bad thing, right? There we go. All right. Uh, so 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 Firebird and Sacred, Maddie is actually a newer student of mine. Um, she's not in our program. She's taking one of my non-majors classes. Oh, let's see. What's this? A butterfly. I don't think there was anything on there about a butterfly. Uh, let's see. 
I don't think Ash. I don't know if Ashley and Velvet popped in. Usually they will pop in for most things I send them. All right, nothing depicted. Nothing depicted. Or oh, batting a thousand here. You know, as disturbing as this room should be, this place is actually kind of peaceful for a change. Oh, there we go. That's that's nice. A human skull. Is that supposed to resemble something? Uh, how many people would be com comforted by a room full of bodies hanging? Alright, alright. Oh, there we are. A shadow. Okay, so we're in the back, far back corner on the top of the stairs. Alright, let me get that one before I forget it. <laughs> yeah, this game. <laughs> Don't forget, I have my brightness settings turned really down on this, so... Um... <laughs> Alright, what am I at? This one? Uh, I think that's the one. Oh, no, that's the one. Okay. I think that's the one. Alright. Alright, there we are. You see, isn't this peaceful? Like, we don't have to deal with Dolores in here. See, this is much brighter now. I can deal with this. Alright. Did I get the right one? Where's the... Oh no, did I get the wrong one? Oh no, there it is. Okay, alright. So we got the shadow. We got the eye. We need the moon. Alright, a moon. Something that resembles a moon. Yeah, Firebird is not an elder. Actually, I would, if I had to guess, I don't, Firebird, do I know your age? I don't know if I know your age. So that's nothing. What? That's the skull. I thought I knew your age, but, oh, Matt. no, it doesn't say anything. I said hey to you earlier, Abby. Oh, you know what? Firebird doesn't know you. It does... <laughs> I'm sorry. Sacred Firebird. Um, Caitlin Corica there. Um, Abby is not actually one of my, my students. Um, she's a student in our programs, and, and um, I just talk with her a lot. Butterfly. Okay, I'm, uh, I'm drawing a blank here. I'm not seeing anything that resembles a... Uh, a two-sided shadow. Could it mean the two wings of the butterfly? Oh, oh, it's the moon. The moon. I'm sorry. I'm, I did the shadow. Okay, it's the moon. Alright, that's it. So, next to this one. I don't think you said hey to Abby. Yeah, we might not be seeing much sunlight here. Um... <laughs> Actually, we will go aside at one point. Um, all right, come on. What am I walking on? Okay, at least I wasn't walking on bodies that time. All right, there we go. That should solve the puzzle. I really need to go look for lighters because I'm going to burn through these really fast. Gotcha. Yeah, I know it's down there. You don't have to keep looking down. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure you're not in my basement, seeing as that's where I, I sleep. And I don't see you here. I actually sleep and play games. Alright, hole in the floor. Why not? 
You know, a lot of the stuff you do in this game is just weird. <laughs> Did somebody call you Birdie? <laughs> Hey, Caitlin. Yeah, that does sound really strange. <laughs> yeah, let's not. Let's let's not. I don't. That sounds weird. Uh, let's see. Is there anything in here? Grace. Of course, it's Grace. It's always Grace. All right. Okay, actually we were going to go to the basement. Wait, what did I get out of that? Wait, I can go back in? This door is always supposed to be locked. Oh, oh, out of save. Okay, my game kind of froze on me there. Alright, she's haunting the basement. That's exactly what I wanted. Alright. Okay, so we. I said I was going to come down here anyway, so I guess it's. I guess it's good that we're here. I don't really want to be down here. Uh, let's see. I'm going to drop the bell bulb. I don't need this. Oh, I hear voices in the room. All right. Let's let's open. All right. I think that goes to I think that's the last puzzle. I don't think I can go through there right now. Oh, yeah, the room's locked. Um, nothing here. Alright, I don't like being down here, but we really have no choice. That's all I have left. Oh. Oh, wow, really? Right there? Oh, I can do this one. Actually, I can do that one very specifically because of that last one. <laughs> no, we don't need to kick her out. Oh, I, I have to. I thought <laughs> I didn't realize I had to move there. Oh, okay. Um, so, Caitlin, Corey, um, Sacred, Firebird, you've all seen this part of the chapter, I think. Oh, hey, lighter. You know what? I don't need a candle. Why is the game making creepy noises? Ah, okay. There's a really interesting Easter egg here. Um,. If I can get out of here. I don't remember how to do this. Uh, <laughs> that's a lot of crosses. Uh, oh, there we are. Uh, what the heck was that? I'm noticing new noises here that I have not experienced before. Some of this is new to me. Alright, come on. Get, get out. Alright, um, so you've all watched Steven play this like a hundred times at this point, because he forgot that he replayed it. <laughs> he never picked this up, the cross. Come on. Uh, okay, you can pick up the cross, and come on. No, don't get stuck. Okay, come on. Okay, this is really awkward. Okay. Do I have the cross? Come on. Alright, stop. Okay, there we go. I just gotta hold the cross up high, I guess. If you take the cross over here... Ever wonder what's in that door? Come on. Alright, we can walk across that now. So, I'm going to show you what's in the door after we finish, finish the puzzle here. Alright. Let's see. Alright. Oh, sorry. I, I missed that. Um, yeah, it, if you stand in the dark in the regular house for too long, you, you get killed. Um, or stop. One or the other. Um... Uh, so standing in the dark will um, promote hauntings, and the hauntings cause you to lose sanity. Um, 
and eventually uh, you'll either get stalked by whatever's in the chapter or other things as you guys have now seen. Uh, wait, did that do anything for me? Uh, you got something for me, bud? Oh, there we are. A bloody knife! Gee, I wonder what that's for. Maybe the seventh knife missing from George's chest? Alright. Alright, so let's cross this, because I don't think any of you have seen this yet. Steven hasn't figured that one out, so don't say anything to him. Um, yeah, you can die in the light. Um, I'm safe in this area right now, as far as I know. If you go into the puzzle rooms, you should be safe, as long as there's not something that is supposed to occur. So, what do you think of that? <laughs> now, personally, I'm going to say, uh, what's that going to do for us in this situation? But at the same time, it's like, you're probably thinking, heck yeah. Yeah. So, uh... <laughs> so that was useless. Uh, there's really nothing, there's no point to that room, just to tease you. Just be like, here, have this, and then, oh, it's actually worthless. Alright, we're done here. We can leave. Um, so what did I get there? I got the knife, so that's for George. Um, we'll go back to George later. We gotta put that knife into George's chest, if you haven't figured that out. Not something I'd imagine doing with my life. Okay, I can't see a thing. Why? Wait, are all the lights off? Oh my god, all the lights are off! Oh, oh my god, the breaker tripped! Okay, this is bad. Okay, okay. That's bad. She can kill me right now, very easily. Okay. We're safe-ish. Oh, she starts haunting me! Come on! No! No! Uh-uh. Just no. Okay. Alright, we got- let's find the rest of the mirrors, then we'll- we'll- we'll go stab George later. Alright. I don't think there's any mirrors in that room. Alright, here we go. Let's see. Okay. I don't think I can do this one right now, but I'm going to check it out. Hey look, light. I don't think there's anything in here I can use. And we need, um, we need a crowbar to get the window open to get the compass, and we need the compass to do the outside part. Because every puzzle in this game is a puzzle within a puzzle. Which I have to say, I actually really like the dynamic of this chapter versus the other two, how different they are. Yeah, the crowbar. Um, let's get that out for now. Oh, uh... Anybody that has seen this before, I'm not, I'm, you probably didn't know about this, that you could break the wall down here. Uh, if you want to see what happens in there, I'll show you later. Um, I'm not doing that in the middle of a chapter. Oh, my lighter's out. Great. I'm just going to let you burn out my hand. Alright. Mirrors. Let's find mirrors. I don't think you can escape this way. I think it's blocked. I can't see anything. I'm not going up there. Oh my god. Why is everything so dark? It's not my brightness settings. I know somebody's going to say that. It's not my brightness settings. Leave him alone. Wait. Did the light burn out? Oh, this is bad. This is bad. The light burned out. I threw my light... Oh, no, I have the light bulb. Okay, never mind. Alright. Yeah, I know. Let me drop it. Alright, let's, uh... 
let's try to turn some lights on here before something kills me. Come on. Oh, okay. I got it. Oh, I was being haunted there, wasn't I? <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> That's bad. All right. Okay. All right, we're alive. I'm going to I'm going to save. Let's uh saving's good. Yeah, not because I'm scared though. I'm saving because progress. Cuz I did stuff. Um, uh, all right. So, we can go upstairs. Um uh, Let's see. Oh, there we go. Okay. Hey, Dolores. Give me my mallet. Right. What took you so long, George? You know when tea time is, and yet you always find a way to be late. Were you in your study room again, scribbling nonsense and talking to your recorder? I'm beginning to think you love your work more than me. I know you tire of me. Oh, yes. I know you'd have me gone in a heartbeat if you could. It's just fine. I'm sorry. I'm just tired. Would you be a doll and fetch me some of my special tea? You know where it is. I'll wait here, George. Okay, so... Um, first of all, we have a key to the tea box, which was in the attic. Um, Dolores... Um, there's some dialogue there that's really important. Also, listen to what she says when you leave. Oh, tape, tape, tape. I'm not sure if everybody caught that, but she says, see you soon, Dwayne. Which is, um, the main character's name. So she... There's a part of her that know, I think might know who you are. I'm not sure on how that works. Um, okay, so we have um, the knife, we have the infusion bag, we have a new tape, and we have a key for upstairs. So we actually have to go upstairs to do some stuff. I'm going to search out some more mirrors. I thought there was another mirror over here somewhere, but... Um, you know... Why is this area so dark? Wasn't there a light over here? You know what? I gotta stop asking that question and just go with it. There, like, there's nothing light about this game. Right. Nope. Oh, this is a bad spot. This is a bad spot. Alright, I'm gonna go break the window here, but I don't think I can do anything until later. There's a, so this is, or the window, the mirror, sorry. This one goes outside. You're probably thinking, outside sounds great, but you can't actually go anywhere out there until you have the compass, which I don't have. So, we'll come back to that. But you know what, let's keep the lighter out. Alright. Firebird, if I missed any doors, could you remind me? I don't know if I mi I know the camera's in there. It's been in there for like like two chapters ago. Come on. There's no mirrors in here, are there? Let's quick, quick, quick. No. Back, back, back. Alright. That room is terrifying. Alright. 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 <laughs> I think we're good. I think we did everything we could down here except for the... Uh, except for... There's got to be something here we missed. Alright, no, let's not stay in here. She can trap me in here. She hasn't haunted... She hasn't hunted me yet. She's haunted me. She hasn't hunted me. Difference. Alright, I'm gonna... Let's, uh... Yeah, let's go upstairs. I think I may have gotten all the... Uh... The mirrors. Alright, come on. Whoa. What the hell was that? Did you see that? There was something standing there. 
Okay, there was something standing right in that doorway. Okay, no, I'm going upstairs. I'm I am done with this basement. No, uh-uh. No, no, no. I'm out. I'm out. But there was something in there. I'm missing a room. There's totally a room I haven't got to yet, and I can't think of where it is. The one with the infusion bag. I can do the infusion bag, but I, I need to find the room first. Uh, I don't think they're... Okay, okay, the house is making noises. I'm getting out of here. When the house starts doing that, it means get out. <laughs> Alright. No, stop making noise. The doors are closed again. Okay. Um. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure. I know where the I can do the knife one at least, so I can go upstairs and do that. Oh, it's right here! Oh my god. Let's do this one. Yeah. <laughs> the game can't auto save because I'm probably being stalked. <laughs> you know what? I'm I'm okay with being down here. Okay, so photos. Recognize that one? Let's see. Oh, okay. I can't see a thing. Alright. <laughs> I literally can't see a thing. I'm going to put you back for now. Oh, that's bad. Oh, okay. I can't even use the lighter. Okay, let, let me uh, open up this door so I have a little bit of light here. Alright, I think the... Uh, so you need to put three paintings on the wall here. The order is actually upstairs in the bedroom. It's the paintings behind the wall. I think I know the order. I think it's the the face gone. Come on. Give me the painting. Oh, I have stuff in my hands. Ah, I'm yelling at the game. All right. The painting. I can't see anything. All right, come on. All right. This was the whole one, so that'd be in the center. Okay, there we go. All right. So I think it's the face gone. Oh, that's the third one. Okay. I can hear the I can hear the uh, heart rate monitor in the other room. From a distance, this also kind of this always kind of reminded me of Pyramid Head in a way. I mean, I know that's not what it depicts, but okay. so we need the there it is. All right. So you gotta, we have the infusion bag. I think that's it. That's our second puzzle piece we needed. Okay, we need five of those. I got two now. We got the moon and we got the sun. All right, progress. We're still under two hours. I, I, I'm hoping we can do this in under three. I think, I think, oh, yeah, I forgot this doesn't work in here. All right, that's the one I was missing, so I think that's all the, all of them. I could probably get rid of the mallet now. Oh, so I forgot I have to actually climb up. All right, you know, so, besides the hauntings and the house acting up, she's kind of left me alone so far. Famous last words. I'm kind of wondering if before we do the final one, if we should try to aggro her. 
All right, um, what do we say we're gonna do next? Come on. We got the knife and we got to, let's do the, let's do the attic quick. Uh, this is bad, I can get cornered up here too. Uh, do you hear that? Uh, that was Dolores. Let's see if she'll troll me again. It's letting me save. She didn't troll me. Huh. Alright, while we're here, might as well uh, listen to the tape. Dolores now has moments of severe psychosis. She loses contact with reality for long periods of time. She hardly remembers me anymore. She's lost her trust in me, and it's becoming harder and harder to administer her treatments. She sometimes forgets where she is, or even the fact that she has to wear clothes. She keeps on scratching her nails or banging her head on doors. She murmurs gibberish sentences and roams aimlessly around the house. The other day, she even accused me of trying to poison her. I'm on the edge. I don't think I can take much more of this. How am I supposed to work, take care of the baby, and deal with her dementia all at the same time? Yeah, we'll go up to the attic here in a second. Uh, then I'll do George's study. Uh, let's see. So he commented about her tea, I think, there. Which is what we're getting. And he commented again about her doing things to herself and walking around naked like the appliances did. So, all right, um, let's head out to the attic. I think we already did this one, right? Yeah. Sometimes she'll appear in that room. All right, all right, let's do this. So we can't finish the attic until we go back downstairs because she's downstairs where she's waiting for the tea. So we'll do George first, then we'll head back down. All right, come on, don't get stuck. Okay, so T, it, it's actually T. <laughs> you read that? It says, <laughs> it's, it's T. <laughs> Remember that. All right, the study is over here. All right, I'm gonna show you guys something. I'm actually going to save it just in case it doesn't auto save. There's a there's a certain something you can do in here <laughs> that I haven't seen Steven do yet. All right, so he's missing the seventh knife, so we are literally gonna stick it back in him. So if you listen to the tapes, he's talked about how Dolores is showing signs of different psychological disorders. Um, one of the biggest ones that jumped out to me would be the dementia and things relating to that. And how she's accused him of poisoning her. So I'm guessing that's what led to her stabbing him to death. And that's a lot of knives to stick into somebody. So like that's, person that's really personal. Um, wait, what did the key say? Uh, love you. Huh. So there's a secret room back here. I don't remember if the key goes in there or not. I think it does. Uh, oh, wait, there it is. Uh, Okay, 
Come on. All right. So George has his knives back. I think there's something in here we can use. Oh, yeah, that's uh okay. Um more infusion bags. Okay. Uh, is there anything in here? No? Alright. Okay. So, the reason I saved the game, just in case the autosave doesn't work, is, uh... George is standing there. And if you leave this room, he starts walking towards you. And the first time I ever played this, I thought, what could possibly go wrong? So let's let, let's see what happens. So yeah, that was George. George is dead. That's not stopping him from walking around. Yeah, I mean, like, most people shut the door when he does that, so... I think I'm the only person I've ever seen him walk into it. Interesting way to die. Something I never knew about before until I tried it myself. I have to do this again? No. Okay. I just gotta go back here again. So, whether George was actually trying to poison her or not is kind of up in the air, but I don't think he was. Uh, I can't count it out, though. She's the one saying it, so I'm assuming he wasn't actually trying to poison her. Because he said that she accused him. So I think she was just Im maybe imagining it, but... I don't know. Come on. Oh, there's handprints on here. I don't think I saw anything in here. You know what? I don't like the sound of the flies. Let's close that. You can stay closed. This won't let me interact back here. I don't even know what that is. Yeah, lovely artwork. I think that's all you gotta do, and he leaves. We all know that didn't stop the insidious friend from getting me. Alright. So, George is gone. Hey, Dolores. Alright, so we got three toys, we got the tea, I think the tea is going to get us the crowbar, and the crowbar will get us the compass, the compass will get us the outside part. Um, you know, kind of blanking on what else we have to do. Alright, we'll, we'll figure it out as we go, I guess. We're almost there. All right, where are we going? Um, the T, so we want to get down to... <laughs> did, I, did I mispronounce crowbar? Or is that just the way it comes out of my mouth? I don't know. Sometimes my accent gets in the way. Oh, really? I don't remember him saying that. 
<laughs> we give Steven such a hard time over so many things. <laughs> Poor guy. Yeah, I'm sorry. I do. I catch most of what's going on in chat. But, oh my God, it's dark! <laughs> Stop turning the lights up. I like that light. All right, all right. Um, Dolores was in which room? Um, the back room, I think. Uh, let's see. This way. She has not aggroed yet, so I think Steven may be onto something with um, what aggroes her. I'm going to try it later on and see if it does it. Because I don't know how I didn't pick up on that. Alright. Alright. So, tea box. It's tea. It, it's literally, like, what does it say? Earl Grey or something like that on it? It's tea. Alright? We all saw that. I'm not trying to poison her. Uh, really? Come on. I guess I don't need this anymore. Unless I don't think I do. Yeah. Tea. <laughs> not poison. I'm not trying to kill Dolores. <laughs> I knew it. I'll show you, you. <laughs> now it's his killer on it. What bread your work? Yeah, so the tea box now says rat killer on it. <laughs> it was rat poison. So was it? Did George actually poison her, or did she, she just think George poisoned her? We know her memory is not what it should be, and she's she's paranoid. A little bit, at least. <coughs> Alright, let's get out of this oven. Yeah, that's not nightmare fuel. Yeah, come on. I wonder if you can actually die in here. Come on. Let's not find out. <laughs> All right. So, oh, we got a toy from that. I didn't know that. Okay. All right. So this this is our last set of puzzles. We got to do the crowbar puzzle to get outside, and we got to do the the toys then we should have the last toy yeah see now it says rat poison suddenly <laughs> that was not poison that I picked up I'm gonna leave the mallet I think I'm done with it you know uh, firebird I don't know if you'd remember but there should be two tapes that I'm missing I don't know if I oh I think I know where I'm missing one actually I'm a... we should go grab it it's upstairs though All right, I think we're up here. I think there was one in that baby monitor room that I missed, or may have missed. I could be wrong. Yeah. I think one's in the baby monitor area. Alright. So we need the compass so we can do the outside part, because otherwise you can't navigate the outdoors. Um, you... It, it trapped. No! Really? Compass? Compass? Okay. Alright. Compass. Okay. Uh, I think that was it, right? 
Let's just leave the window open. It's a nice breeze. Alright. Okay, so I think uh, the... It's this... the stairs we need to go to. There we are. Look, light, <laughs> actual light. We're outside. Oh my god, he's actually running. Look at he's actually running. Yeah, he's not been doing that the whole game. Alright, let's see. So if you don't have the compass, you can't navigate. You gotta follow the compass needle. I guess it's not that important that I have all the tapes, but I'd like to get them while we're playing it. So if you're to walk off into the abyss either direction, it'll back, it'll automatically put, bring you back to where you last were. And I believe it's directing you to these, which is your trail. So not a, not really a collectible as far as I'm aware. I think it's just telling you where to go. The compass is homing in on the flowers. <laughs> now it's a now it's a Brit it's a good sprint. I mean this is what we should be doing in the house. Right? Like that run in the house, that should be the walk. This should be a, this should be like the run. Okay. This way. Can I walk through that? No, I cannot. Alright. Here we are. Okay. This place is eerily creepy and really reminds me of um, Silent Hill Downpour a lot. Like, you'd think being outside is a nice place to be, but it really is unsettling. Now there is kind of a easter egg out here. I don't know exactly where it is though. This place is kind of confusing. I'm going to see if I can find it. I don't know if it's really an easter egg. It's actually kind of a important story thing. Alright, so this is for Dolores. Actually, I think we do need to look at some of the cassettes. There's something that they say on one of them that's really important, and I want to find that one at least. I don't think they've said it yet. It actually links this to the previous chapter, if you know what I'm referring to. And that's our last of the toy puzzle. Okay, so before we get out of here, I was kind of hoping to find something. Um, there's a grave you can go to. Now they don't really say whose grave that is, but since it's a cradle, I'm going to assume that was Dolores' baby. Oh, this opened. Okay. That was not open before, right? Alright. Uh, I, I don't know where I'm going. I'm just kind of running around here. So I know there's a mausoleum that you need to go to to get out of here, which I believe is up there. But there is something, like I said, a grave you can visit. That's important. 
they don't really confirm what it is, but I'm pretty sure I know. I don't know if I'm going the right way, though. <laughs> they just ran in circles. Oh, that's it. I think. No, it's not. Never mind. Never mind. I'm just me being stupid. What else is there? Alright, uh, it might be one of these. Firebird, do you know which one I'm talking about? I don't know if Sacred's still out there. That's it. Alright, that's it. This is a little weird, but I think I understand it. Yeah, okay. Hey, Sacred. Glad you're still here. Um, so if you caught that... Um, the only reason I can think of that somebody would do that at a grave, because that sounded like... <laughs> I don't know. How would you describe that? I'm guessing that's the grave of his one of his family members. I just don't know why there's only one grave. Or maybe his own. I mean, the graveyard is kind of... A mess. I can't understand why else he would pay respects at a grave and he would react like that. Kind of a hypothesis I've had going for a while. I think I'm just assuming it's one of the kids or something. Or him. Because the only reason I could think of that would be alone is that they wouldn't want him buried with the family after what he did. Remember how the game starts with you putting the gun to your head after shooting everybody in your family. Not cool. Alright, so here's the way out. Last of the flowers. Alright, so like I said, not collectibles, those are just telling you where to go. So I don't I think you do need to pick them up, but I don't think Steven found that grave on his first playthrough. I think he found it on the last two playthroughs. Yeah. In fact, I'm, I'm going to build on that um, murder-suicide introduction after the chapter if anybody's interested in seeing it. I showed Firebird already, and I kind of want to see the see it play out in the end, so... Because it's interesting. Alright, so we have all the puzzle pieces. So, we gotta go up to the bedroom. Um, I don't need this anymore. I'm gonna drop both of these. I don't need them. Alright. I think we're done here. I can't think of where all the tapes are, but I'll get the ones I... the one I... I uh... What was that? <laughs> I think that, that might have been a hunting. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> I wonder if Caitlin and Corey are still out there, if they went to bed already. I don't know what the weather conditions are like there right now. Alright, um, so before we do the the puzzle, yeah, door is closed again. Oh, she's back in the laundry room. <laughs> yeah, I kind of figured you might still be out there. Is Corey with you? Right, I'm going to just leave her there. She's fine. She ain't hurting anybody. Yeah, so if, if she's active like that, you can't save. It blocks you from saving. It, you can... The one thing that most people probably are afraid to do is approach her for obvious reasons. Um, 
but if you do approach her in most cases, she'll just disappear. Oh, oh, you actually had to open the door to get her to disappear. Okay. Alright. Yeah, good night ahead of time, Caitlin. And, uh, Corey. I think the... Okay, so I think... Oh my god, is she in the shower right now? <laughs> That's right behind me. <laughs> okay, I don't like... I did not like that. Oh, I'm not in the dark. Not in the dark. There it is. There it is. No. Why are you closing? No. Let me out. This is such a long, dark hallway. Right, open. Is she gonna troll me? Uh, what was that? The lights? Alright, I'm gonna do a, uh, I'll, I'll do a save. Okay, let's do here. Alright, so let's, uh, let's listen to that tape before we use the toys. I now fear for the baby. She has become obsessed with him. She says she can always hear him cry over the baby monitor, even when it's off. She has trouble differentiating him from the dolls in the house. Once she threw a doll away, realizing it wasn't the baby. I am horrified at the idea that she might do the same to the baby, thinking she's holding a doll. I've got rid of all the dolls in the house, and now she keeps on calling him, never remembering where he is. I have to keep a constant eye on both of them. The only time I can get some work done is when she's sedated. <sighs> it feels like a nightmare. Okay. I think I'm still missing the one I'm thinking of. Uh, let's see. I might have to re-listen to the first one again. It may be the first one I'm thinking of. Oh, uh, we're here. So the, the baby toys, this is the puzzle. Come on. Yeah, I bet she's nearby. That's why I can't save. Okay, so we got a music symbol on a key. Um, there was a music box in this room, I think. Uh, right next to the tape player. And if I remember, that's going to give us a, a record for the player downstairs. Okay. Alright. So, that is it. We're basically done with this uh, chapter beyond this our last puzzle. What's that? Uh, what is that? It's not letting me do anything with it. Oh! Oh! No! Don't hunt me. Oh! I can knock him off the wall. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, I, I'm sorry, Sacred. I didn't mean that. Like, um, I'm just doing this for Firebird, but Firebird specifically requested this game. Requested this game. Sorry. Um, I'll play um, whatever you guys want me to play. As long as I, I mean, as long as I want to play it. <laughs> uh, let's try it. I'm gonna try the room. We're at the end, so how bad can it be? <laughs> Famous last words. 
It's jammed. Uh. Oh yeah, it's working already. Oh my god. <laughs> this is bad. I should not have done that. Why am I? Why am I doing this on purpose? Hey, if Caitlin wants to see White Day, I'd be happy to play it for you guys. I love that game. I do that for everybody. Your Lord. Okay, Steven got her to not kill him. him. Uh, the light is not working. Very nice, Saker. Alright, I might die here. I'm not going over there. Come here. Nope. Come here. I will not. Come here. Come here. The house is getting Come angry. Here. Oh my god, it, it didn't, wait. Oh, I never unlocked this door. No wonder, <laughs> all right, out, I'm out. All right, let's see if she hunts me now. I wanna see if she hunt me. I gotta play around with this a little bit. So let's just walk around a bit and see if she does anything. I'm gonna check on Rose. She hasn't called me at all. <laughs> okay. She left me like three or four messages in the last, my first playthrough. Okay. Steven's very rarely wrong about things in games. If he thinks that's what triggers it, I believe him. Not seeing anything though. Okay. I'm gonna save and just hope it doesn't get bad. So if you do walk into the closet, she stabs you. I know that. This is usually the area where she jumps me the most. She hasn't done it once. See how it says there's a message? That shouldn't be flashing. Okay. All right. Well, is that a cup? That's a glass. Why is that there? One beer can. The phone? Yeah, it could be, or it could be because I'm in between chap uh, in a chapter. I mean, um, every time I answered it, I swear it was before a chapter or after a chapter. Uh. Oh! Oh my god, she's triggered! Oh. <laughs> she's after me. Oh, okay, she's right there. She's right there. She's right there. Oh god. He was right. He called it. That's what triggers it. It's the room. If you let her out of the closet, I guess. You know, usually it's a good thing when people come out of the closet. Not this closet. <laughs> All right, let's go downstairs. Let's get this over with. Okay. Well, now that I know that, I mean, 
She's way more fun when she's active. Now she's gonna stalk me down here and I in this dark basement. Why did I do that? Why did I save? She starts chasing me. Come on. Uh, well, where do I use it? Ah, okay. Yeah, just FYI, this gets a bit loud. Not like in a terrible way, but I think it's supposed to be. So this is the room earlier that wouldn't open. Alright, so, <laughs> it's kind of a maze. You basically don't want to go in a direction if you hear creepy noises. I've actually pushed the buttons of that a bit. I don't think the creepy noise does anything to you. But it's still creepy. I really want to find that cassette or re listen and make sure I didn't miss it. I don't know if I can anymore though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, avoid the creepies. I'm surprised I remember this so well. Uh, I think we're going up. Oh, no, 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 no. Ooh, okay, okay. All right, I'm not testing you again. I don't want to die. You know what? Um, Point out the fact that you can see her in these windows. Kind of taking the atmosphere out of this by running through it. But she's doing different things in different rooms. I mean, nothing mind blowing, but. I mentioned I have a fear of heights. A really bad fear of heights. I don't remember where to go from here. Apparently that was the correct way. That's it. That's the door. into darkness. Uh, I'm just thinking about the next chapter already and I'm like, I don't know. God, the chapter. It's so dark. Because it says these chapters weren't bad enough. Okay. 
So this place might look familiar. Those are the three po photos from behind um, the wall in the room, the bedroom. Now I actually never noticed this before, but Steven pointed out that the hatch to the attic is right there. Um, so she went up to the attic and jumped through the hole, I believe, and hung herself that way. See, I missed a tape. Darn. Dang, I thought for sure I would have got that last one. Uh, no, they didn't change it. That's the way it always went. Notice, notice the tape recorder and their photo is now there. It's like the realities are blending. Because that was not there before. That one I know for sure. Um, so, we got a mirror and a new tape. No, I think they showed the whole thing, unless they changed it. Okay. Uh, I think so, a little bit. I didn't- I wasn't really doing anything, I just let it go straight forward. The house is seriously screwing with me already. I just got done with the chapter. Alright. Lights. Um, okay, so. Like I said, realities are blending. We have a photo of George and um, Dolores. We have the tape recorder. I'm going to quickly listen to that, that last tape. So just uh, schizophrenia, behavioral development, part two. Let, I hope you guys don't mind. I just want to, uh, I just want to try these quick. Just really quick. Dolores' symptoms are aggravating. Doctors tell me it's become very hard to pinpoint the exact disorder. They tell me she's got symptoms of schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, psychosis, dementia, and more. I don't know what to do anymore. It feels like the treatments are only making things worse. That's it. That's Today the part. she told me she often hears her own voice whispering a sequence of five numbers through the baby monitor. Okay, we don't need to hear the rest. That's what I wanted to hear. Um, the treatments only seem to be making it worse. Steven pointed this out before and I had never noticed it. Lucy was the syringe. Dolores the treatments. Dwayne's a drug addict. Everything's coming back to some kind of medication in some way. Oh, the noose is there. <laughs> I didn't realize that. Oh, lights around. Okay. So it was actually the first tape that gave that away. I don't know if that's just a coincidence in all these cases, but I'm kind of wondering if there's not a connection there between them. So if we follow that story, um, the way I see it is that it's pretty straightforward. Um, 
Dolores and uh, George had a child, Dolores started showing uh, psychological or symptoms of psychological disorders. Uh, I don't think they pinned down a diagnosis for her, and they're treating her for symptoms with comorbidities. And uh, apparently they weren't working, and she was getting worse. Yeah, maybe it could be. That's actually not a bad thought. Um, so if you follow that through, she ends up um, thinking, getting paranoid about George. Uh, thinks George is trying to poison her. I don't think George was. I'm not. I don't know that for sure though. And um, and eventually killed George. Hung herself. I believe the baby died because we did find the crib out in the graveyard. So, that that's my thoughts on it. The other thing that I don't really have an answer to is why she referred to me by my name, after. Ah, uh, go away, black spots. Wait, is the upstairs one still gone? Oh, it's small again. Okay, so he can spawn for a period of time and then come back. I get it. Okay, so I I, I don't know if um she knows me when uh, or knows me by name. Like if we're about like if we would have known each other in the same existence kind of thing, or if um or if it just has to do with this reality we're in or that we were in during the story. I was leaning towards the idea that there might be a connection, but I'm not sure. Um, okay. So, that's that's it for that particular chapter. So, how about... Uh, do you guys want to try to figure the tapes out? We got three more now, still. So. Oh, uh, uh, basement, right? Yeah, it could be, because like I said, the realities are blending, so I'm not entirely sure that there is a connection there. Am I oh, come on. Um, really? I just turned you off. Alright, uh, let's, um, let's check out the basement, actually, before I forget again. Let's open up windows. <laughs> open up some windows. Explore some areas. Make sure the lights are on. Oh, yeah, that was on. Yeah, the radio is really annoying. Uh, let's check the progress room. I think we get we did three videos so far, so we have the three parts of the mask. We got these two, so we just need to do um, Rakin's chapter and then finish the videotapes. Yeah, the picture's still there. See, realities are blending a little bit. I said the birdcage from Lucy is in the kitchen. I don't like I said I don't remember if that was there from the beginning or not, but the fact that it's there. Rose. Why is that not? I wonder if that's glitched. There was something there. All right. If you guys want to know, I can tell you what happens. Uh, maybe uh maybe it's the videotapes or 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 you know what. I bet it's the comic book that triggers it. I do not know where the comic book pages are. Alright. While we're exploring the house, I'm going to take a look for them. Um, I'm just going to look very briefly as we go around, because I do want to... i got to figure out how to activate those tapes. Might as well look around while we're here. Uh, you guys hear that? <laughs> yeah, I want you to hear them too. Um, Rose's messages are really interesting and really worth hearing, and it makes me question a lot of things in this game. The problem is, I think I might need the comic books. Oh, come on, really? I thought it was a cat almost. I don't, I don't know what trick if the comic book pages disappear, or how that works exactly. I got the one from the room next to the garage. I don't know if any... Let's see. 
I'll try to look for them. I can't guarantee I'm gonna find them. There's, I think there's like four of them, and I got one so far. I'll try. I mean, we could always look up their locations, but I need more lighters. Like, this is getting... I'm getting low here. Come on. Wait, why aren't you opening? Oh, uh, wait. Was that... There was something in there. Oh, hey. A lighter. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Give me that. Haha. <laughs> Alright. Double fisting lighters. Alright. Yeah, you could try to find them if you want. I don't mind. I've already, like, collectibles. I don't really care about finding them. I want to figure out the videos. I think that would be kind of fun to do. Before we give up. I don't want to give up on the videos yet. Like, let's try to figure those out. But, um, if you want to look up the locations, that's fine. Because let's save us a bit of time here. This house is, is just so... It's I don't know, to me it's really well designed. I love I love the house. And there's just so much to it. Like it's been built onto for the over the years. Right, come on. Close. We're done. Right. If I don't close these it's gonna bother me. My my apologies. <laughs> That's boring. <laughs> Alright, there you go. Okay. Alright. I think there, I always thought there was one over here too, but it might be, it might need, might need to read the comics as well. I haven't read any of them. Um, I could have swore you can just find them though. All right, the house is pretty quiet right now. I'm liking this. Yeah, I can't stand drawers being left open. Yeah, if you got any, if you got places to look, just give me them. Um, I'll I'll hit them up while I find them. If I'm close by, I'll get them right away. Yeah, you can put them up. Just just locations, so. I would say try to avoid your own spoilers there, because I, I know what's in them, but... Some of them are tucked, like, under things. One might be the bed. Alright, did that already. I'm gonna pop that new video it well no maybe I won't that might be the really bad one let's wait off uh, let's hold off on that video for a second okay yeah I got the first one that's the first one I found or the only one I found I actually that's the only one I actually knew ahead of time Second, after the second phone call. Oh no! So I do have to get called from her. Oh, what if I have to read the comic book then? She hasn't called me. Okay, well that 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 doesn't help really then. Okay, maybe I actually have to look at it. Um, I don't, what do you, is that all I have? Oh, no, there we go. I don't think I've ever actually read the comic book. I just listened to her phone calls because they pretty much explain it all. Yeah, so it is four pages. 
Okay. See if there's a way to trigger her phone call, because that might be what I'm doing wrong. Uh. I didn't say anything. I don't think I got that. No, I don't think I did. Let me look. Oh, there it is. I can see it from here. Okay. Let's check that one out. House is getting a little noisy. Okay. So we have pages one and two, basically. Uh, the room just closed on me, didn't it? Okay. Oh, you know what? I think the comic book is about when Dwayne um, shot himself. Oh, that blob got bigger. <laughs> I think it's the hauntings that do it. I could be wrong. close those. Alright, um, I'm gonna run down. I, I didn't do the basement part and I said I was going to. We still got uh, four bullets to go, so we might as well do them. Are you still not working? That's the wrong switch. Have I been pushing the wrong switch? Ah, uh, I don't know. Okay. Um, here we are. Let's do this. So if you haven't seen this before, Sacred, this is in the basement. There's a big plaster area. If you check it, it says it looks like it can be broken. Uh, I thought you needed the mallet to break it. Oh, okay. We'll go to the phone then after this. So, uh, Sacred, if you're still out there, this is the room from the beginning when he killed the family. Um, you'll notice there's two shots missing. That's because I already did this to myself twice. So it's fully loaded when you first get down here. Why I don't know. Yeah it's fully loaded when you first get down. Um, I put it to my head twice and I'll show you. You'll see what happens. Pay attention to the floor at the door. Because I, I can't stop him from walking. Yeah, and they give you little hints too about how to complete the game. Yeah, see the crutch moved. The crutch was on the stair is on the stairs now in the game. When I originally first played this, the crutch was actually on the door. Or next to the door. That chapter. Oh, that chapter is so creepy. <laughs> See the marks on the floor? And how he purposefully looks down at them. Okay. There we go. Remember how nice and sweet Rose was? Thing I've ever had to do is wrench the remote control. 
controller from his hands. It's the only thing he loves more than me. Probably because of the mute button. I could just go on and on and on and on about things. But look at me talking your ear off. Maybe he's right about that mute button. Just never mind. Dwayne, I'm sorry. I'll let you go now. Talk soon. Now, if you remember that first conversation, or that first message she leaves you at the beginning of the game, she sounds like she's just worried about you, because she hasn't seen you leave the house. To me, that was just weird. Like, suddenly she's really negative. Oh! 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 There he is! Okay. Gotta move. Gotta move. following me oh oh god that scared the crap out of me oh jeez. okay no oh, stop come on that guy jumped on me when he dissipated he must not have known where I was all right uh, let's we'll see the first floor TV room in front of the TV. So right here. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh. Oh. No. No. Lights, please. You know, White Day is gonna be a field, field. <laughs> a fun-filled um. Joyride compared to this. <laughs> Alright, which page was that? Okay, so we're right, right next to it. Alright, so we got a body being wheeled out. I don't know if there's a way I can... Oh, it's Lucy. Okay. That's when Lucy died. I'm sorry. It's been a while since I looked at these. Okay, so the first page is about Lucy. She's trying to talk to Frank and he's watching TV. <laughs> okay, Frank. The cops come to talk to her. See, I'm not really good with this dialogue thing. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh yeah, I got that one. What about the top one? Okay. So. He's drinking something. Okay, so I'll come back to that one. All right, what'd you say it was, Firebird? Oh, let me see. Oh, you don't have to tell me. It's right there. Uh, connecting closet between... Okay, so it's right over here. There we go. Go check that out. Oh, wow, that got big fat. <laughs> yeah, they're like, the game's just like, no, we don't want you to feel safe between chapters anymore. That's gone. Alright, um. Wasn't gawking at him, he just seems like a nice young man. Oh, sure, I heard all about you telling your sister about your new 
rugby player neighbor. Oh, that's Raken. He's talking about Raken. Um, Raken's a rugby player. Wasn't gawking on me. Just seems like a yes. Okay. Uh, hello, Dwayne. It's Ro. Okay. Oh, I. You know what? I wonder if that's giving us a timeline. Did I miss Dolores in there? That's when she calls you at the beginning. Could you call me? Just let me know everything's fine. Okay, chill out. All right, bye bye. Okay, so that's it. I didn't see anything about Dolores. Oh, I bet that's Dolores right here. Okay, all right. So it is literally just the neighbors watching us. Hence why they call the comic Neighbors. <laughs> Alright, I don't know if that's going to trigger another phone call or not. Yep, that's bigger. That one's gone for now. At least the nice thing about the, the oil dude is that he just... Why did I leave these all open? He just spawns... Um, spawns from those tar, tar spots, basically. So, you know, we don't really need to, uh, there we go. Alright, let's see what she has to say this time. if you stay at home or go elsewhere but don't come here I s think there's one more phone call from her um I wanna save I'll do a quick lap see if it triggers and I'll go look at the comic books again if it doesn't but I think I already saw everything, so... And I guess we can check out that new tape, see what that does. Okay, nothing this time. That might be the last one, or it might just need to... I might need to trigger an event to get it to go. All right, so let's let's do the tape. Uh, tape. Oh, you know, I said I was gonna do the basement twice in my mind. I don't know if I said that out loud. I'm gonna do the basement one more time. Um, wrong way. I wanna I wanna do the full basement thing by the end. So I just figured I'll knock out a few at a time. notice like I said it gives you little hints on how to finish the game so it's not a bad thing to do just don't go too far I have a feeling I missed some hints here last last night when we did this
Okay, so it's just telling me to basically finish the chapters. See how the crutch is in the corner by the door. It says not it's on the stairs now. I wonder if people were like weren't seeing it. And if you didn't know where the basement was, you didn't get the hint. I bet that's why they moved it. Okay, so four tally marks now. Alright. So I guess let's uh punish our minds a bit and try to figure out these tapes. So Rose isn't quite um, as friendly as she first seemed. So I always found that to be interesting. See how it's right here now? And that was right here originally. Alright, so we did the first two tapes on here. We got a new one. Uh, let's see. Negligence. I, I, uh, I'm trying to remember all these. I don't know, I don't particularly want her coming over. <laughs> Alright. This might actually be the one I was thinking of from the last one. The last uh, videos we watched. Yeah, okay. This is the basement one, I bet. See how the wall's gone? That's the, uh... That's where the gramophone and TV are in the basement. So I think I know how to do this one. And it's kind of cool. It's actually a, a interesting one. So the game's been implying that Dwayne's an alcoholic and he's a drug user. They really haven't said what he takes. All we know is that there's pills all over the house. So this is going to kind of push on some of that. If I remember. Sacred, I don't think you've seen these yet, uh, other than maybe watching Steven play them, but basically, um, if you look at the progress room, there's three items for the three chapters of the people that you're learning about, and then there's a mask that you're kind of slowly putting together, and you get a mask, mask piece every time you complete a videotape, and the videotapes look like they're old family videos that have been partially recorded over with hints as to where the mask pieces are, and I think I'm on a loop now. Um, so once you loop the video, um, you can basically go and find um, stuff in the house that will trigger events. Uh, I think I know that one. Negligence one. I think that's the one at the sofa. Um, this way. No, not this way. Um, what am I thinking of? Yeah, there's a, there's a, Steven's watched a couple of them, but I don't think he's quite figured them out yet. He, he might have ideas, he hasn't said, but there we are. See that? This was not there before. Okay. I did not know I could pick that one up. Ah, uh, what? Oh, the door. You know, I don't like loot. I don't. I don't like that black spot just being that right there. So yeah, that doesn't happen every day. At least not to me. I don't know about you guys. I don't really need this. Can you guess what I'm here to buy? Watch the shelves. Today there's no special. Yeah, if Sacred wants to watch me choke to death like 500 times. Yeah, beers are the only things with a special price today. 
Let's see what we got. Shopping cook at that bad. We've got all the needs for food, especially drinks covered. It's hot outside. <laughs> beer would be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of beer. Fill that void in your soul, wouldn't it? I've had some pretty embarrassing visits to the store before, but it's mostly just stock. It's not like I go home and drink it all right away. Uh, it's four hours. Um, we did Lucy. We did Lucy pretty quick. I don't think it took us that long. It's pretty spectacular scream in there. <laughs> On my part. <laughs> um, the last like like two hours, I think, are mostly us looking at tapes. Some of them are really hard to figure out. This one is pretty straightforward. <laughs> the, vin the tape took us, the four tapes, or three tapes we did, took us longer than the chapter. Plus I got jilted out of lighters at the beginning, so I spent like a, probably a half hour or so looking for lighters before we started the chapter. So if, you have a, if you've been listening to the intercom, it's been just talking about picking up beer, and it's referred to me by name already, so... Oh yeah, this is the same chapter. Okay, now come on. That's that's not how you drink beer. All right, Sarah, it's time for bed now. Daddy, I want a story. I think it would be great if you told her a bedtime story, Twain. In a while. Daddy? Are you just going to ignore her? Always ignoring us, glued to your fucking beers. You don't talk, you don't sleep in the bedroom, you don't get out at all, you just don't care, do you? Why don't you just leave? Yeah, so he vomited up the mask fragment. So it is the same house. I just don't understand why the room he killed them all in was in the basement to begin with. Uh, wait, is that room still bleeding? Uh, is that going to go away? Let's go check out the progress room. 
Wow, I'm like wobbling around. That effect was really good. So, like I said, if you pick up the mask pieces, they just add on to this. So I don't know if it says anything. Yeah. Alright. So that tape is done. I'm not sure what I can do with the record, to be honest. Why I was able to pick that up. Oh, the room shuts. Okay. Alright, we're back to normal. Okay. Well, let's, uh. That was an easy tape. <laughs> I still don't know what to make of the other two tapes that we were trying to figure out. I, I have no idea what to do with them yet. So we are uh, missing... Wait. Uh, two, okay. Because one of them we're going to get from Rakin's chapter. Alright. I guess let's watch them again and see. So this one is... Uh, affliction... I know where this goes, I just don't know how to get to it. Like, I know I've seen these before, but if you don't think about it or use it, you know, you forget it. So, I think, so I think that's a well. Because I know that well. Or one that looks like it. I think this is the one that had the vault door on it. Yeah, there it is. There's another place I know that has something like that. I don't remember if it's the same place. And that is that room I can't figure out, which I think might be Dolores' mirror room. So now that we can go in the mirror room, I suppose let's check that. That might answer our quest the question I have. I think we're on a loop now, so... Yeah, okay. Alright. Okay, I sorry, I thought I heard something there. Uh let's see. That's it, Firebird. That's the shot. It's got the lights, it's got the curtain type thing. I'm in the right room. Uh. Do I have to do something? The door doesn't open. Close. I don't want to be near that black blot thing. Um, just furniture. Okay. Um, if you guys have ideas. I'm listening. This is definitely the room, though. I don't know if the candle makes any difference here. Oh, okay. Out, out, out. Um, before he starts moving around. I want to see if I can find a candle quick. Nope. 
At least the house is relatively quiet right now. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> you did that on purpose. Not sure where to find candles offhand. I could use more lighters too. You can never have too few lighter too many lighters. Um you're supposed to be open. Let's see how it brings us back out. Um, why are these open? Oh, oh, they weren't. Okay, never mind. Um, yeah, I'm really not sure. Where would I find a candle? So one thing was confirmed for me before we started Dolores' chapter. Um, <laughs> well, I can't get to a candle store. <laughs> I can't leave the house. That would be a good place to look. Um, the thing that was confirmed is that the black spots can become active before you start Reagan's chapter. So... I did not know that was that's how that worked. Since the black spots can become active, that makes me wonder if other things can happen. Uh, I know there are candles somewhere. Pills. Uh, this is the lighter situation all over again. Light bulbs. Oh, lighter. Oh. Wait, did I take two lighters? Whoa! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, no. No, 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 no. Okay, you can uh, stay over there. Just go away. Ah, that guy, he gets me every time. Oh! <laughs> the despawn gets me worse than him. Oh, uh, oh, why? <laughs> why do I play games like this? Why do I do this to myself? No, 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 no. Huh? I'm standing here. You can't do anything. Finally gave up. Thank you. We gotta check out this room later too. Okay, well at least his black gooey puddle thing is gone. Um Yeah. I have a feeling the game is just chipping me out of candles at this point. I found the room. I just don't I don't know if the candle's gonna do anything to be honest. No, nope. Light that doesn't work. Nope. All right, upstairs. <sighs> yeah, upstairs towards the black spots. Smart. All right. Um. I guess there could be some up up upstairs. I haven't gone up there yet. Uh, what was that? That was weird. Oh, uh, okay.
don't come out. No, you're back. No. Just leave me alone. Like, I know Dwayne probably deserves this, but... Yeah, this is candles all over again, or lighter all over again. We haven't done that yet. Can't do that yet, technically. Nope, we'll get to it later. Nope, uh. <laughs> yeah, I remember I did that to Steven once, too. It did it so badly, it gave him a candle and then told him it wasn't in his inventory anymore. <laughs> Even though it was clearly there. <laughs> so, it's not just me. Alright, let's uh, flip this. I don't know if this is going to do anything, but... Uh, well, we checked out the other tape, but um, the other tape even confused me more. The problem with the other tape is it shows you so many flashes of the house that I'm like, none of the rooms are, oh, that's the videotape. I was like, what is that? Like nothing, nothing, I don't know, like nothing was consistent. It's like they had you jumping all over the place. Um, I'm going to check that already. Yeah, I don't know. This should be a really obvious one, I feel. I wanna, I wanna, let's check the room out again. Let's, uh, um, let's see. Wait, why is that open? I shut that. showed this spot which is why I'm thinking a candle and I'm betting that door unlocks this to the place I'm thinking of but okay I need to think on that one a little bit all right usually there is a candle that spawns up here it wasn't there last time because I think I used it. It'd be right there. Sometimes one spawns here. I mean, can I not just take one of these? This room is usually good for supplies. I haven't checked the back room. I suppose there could be something in here. I think I cleared this room out, but... Did the Omega box earlier. Oh, Matryoshka doll. <laughs> you just kind of stumble across those. The last Matryoshka doll I only found because of the walls disappearing because of that um, hot chocolate thing okay uh, what's in these? can't open that yeah I know I know there we go Well, I suppose I can check them again. Keep in mind I reloaded. Why? 
I have a feeling to get a candle, I'm probably going to need to reload. I dropped a candle at some point. I just don't remember where. You know, that door is going to get in my way. If I need to move. Oh, this might be a good spot. Come on. Uh, no. Closet. Uh, no. The only reason I'm kind of fixated on this one is because I don't know how to do the other puzzle at all, and this one I actually know where I'm going. The problem is there's nothing there. If I were a candle, and I were in a house in the 80s, where would I be? Plenty of beer can- oh, uh, no, no, uh, please no. That's shadow, like why would you set up a tarp like that? Are you like trying to give yourself a heart attack every day? Okay. I don't think there's anything over here other than just going upstairs. Okay, no. I guess we can try the other other tape, but I might need your brain power on that one, guys. That one was kind of that one was throwing me off. I left you open. I wonder if that closes automatically. So usually there's candles. Uh, what was that? <laughs> usually there's candles all over this place. Uh, let's see. Well, I'm confuzzled. All right. I mean. If you need a candle for something like that, you think the game would auto spawn some for you? Uh oh yeah, that's right. Our oily boy spawned over here, didn't he? Of course it is. I'm overusing it. There was one in here earlier. Oh my god, the light actually starts dimming. <laughs> um, I did not notice that before. That's kind of a cool effect, I have to say. Yeah, I know. I'm confident I'll find more. I mean, honestly... Rickon's chapter is so, so dark, they have to give you lighters. Like, you can't see a dang thing in that game. Or that game, that part. Sometimes they appear over here. Uh, uh, I mean, I don't know.
the milk is still left. You should put the milk away when you're done, I mean. Oh yeah, don't forget the black goop is in here too. The reason I was curious about the black goop being early versus late game is because that plays into Reagan's chapter. Um, I don't even know why, I just know it does. And it also plays into some of the uh, tapes. I have a feeling that the tape that I'm thinking of, the one I was afraid of, is from Rankin's chapter. I don't think it's any of the ones we have, because I think I would have I would have triggered it by now. Like, automatically. I think it triggers as soon as you watch that tape. The one where you get stuck in the basement. Alright, I don't know. Oh, let's do one more sweep for the upstairs. I don't want to give up on this. I really don't want to drop it. Uh, what the hell was that? Oh, the light's just weird. No. The house is starting to act up. <laughs> I don't know if I want to check all these again. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I have the patience for that. Reagan's chapter... Um, long enough, I would say. It's not, it's kind of more like Lucy's. You can actually kind of run through it. It's, uh, I, w I would say it's going to probably take me a little time, though. Those dark parts of that game are really hard to see in, and even with, even if I turn the brightness up for them, they're going to be hard to navigate. So it's definitely not a tonight thing, I don't think. <laughs> As much as I would love to start it. Dolores' chapter is the longest just because of the confusion it throws at you. Okay, so... I've never checked these, I don't think. I mean, other than early on. You're getting desperate when you're checking the medicine cabinet candles. Alright, I don't know. I might have to just give up on this one for now. That or I might just have to look up if that's it. I mean, at this point I know the room. If it's really a candle, I might be screwed for now. Firebird, do you want to check that one for me? If that is the case, um, I'm just going to need to have to progress first. Going to need to have to. Is that how you say that? Yeah, um, or if there's something else, because I could just, I, yeah, either or, I mean, honestly, if I'm going in the wrong direction, I don't see how I could be, but it's possible. I'll just kind of keep searching for a second if you want to do that for me. If you don't mind. Um... I think that one was Affliction. Yeah, Affliction. I think. Let me pop it out just to check. Yeah, Affliction.
Uh, why are you uh? Isn't there? Oh. these drawers so many times I don't remember which ones anymore. <laughs> if I would check every one. Come on, just up here. Just maybe it's stupid, that's fine. The crowbar, really? Huh. Why would you get that? Yeah, I was like I was gonna say I didn't think the game would make you have to have a candle, but that's the only thing I could think of. Um Okay. Maybe to maybe to unblock the door or something. Alright, let's go get it. The game hasn't said anything about it. So I suppose I should have checked the walls, but... Crowbar. Oh, uh, you know what? That's why it needed me to be in that room, too. That was the hint. I was taking it the right way. I mean, I kind of figured that out, but... Okay. I'm assuming it's the same room, because it is the right room on the thing. Oh, I'm doing the wrong one. No? Uh. So the angle was pointed this way. Oh, the floor. How obvious. Oh, come on. Can I examine it? This is starting to ring some bells. <laughs> okay. All right. Well. Thank you for the help, Bear Bird. Okay. Let's. Uh Oh. <laughs> interact. Why would I interact? Uh. <laughs> a boy standing in the dark. Really? I'm literally in a cave. <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> I'm like literally standing in a... There we go. Vault door. Okay, I know this place. This is the one I was thinking of. I think there's a connection to not only Dwayne, but the thing in the house as well. And I think this is it. I could be wrong. Oh, I'm ducked. <laughs> I, was, I was like, why? Uh... I don't remember how to do this place, but I think it ends up at a well. I guess that's not helping that much. Alright.
very uh, industrial. So the other place we were at, it was very. Um, it looked like they're doing some kind of chemistry there where we broke where I broke the pipe. Um. I'm guessing this is the same place, and it has to do with where Dwayne works or worked. Riding on the assumption that he is actually dead. I mean, yeah, why not? What could go wrong? So, some kind of chemical engineering or something like that, maybe. Uh, maybe they were. Maybe it's a pharmaceutical company. That's where he gets his pills. Maybe, maybe the pharmaceutical company is what's causing the problems with all these people. Is what I'm thinking. But if that's what it is, I could be way off on that. I don't know. this place is what I'm trying to figure out. That's the only thing I could think of is that he worked here. I have no idea where I'm going. I don't know why my instinct was immediately to go upstairs, but... Oh yeah. Oh, this is the place I was thinking of. Okay. I believe this is going to give us some information. Can I open the lockers? Nothing interactable. I mean, nice place. Okay, none of those are interactable. Want to bet that one of them is interactable? <laughs> okay. That's not blood, right? It's black. It's oil-ish type stuff, I believe. That thing in the house is covered in it. locked. Well, alright. Guess that means I gotta find something to unlock it. My instinct to go right upstairs brought me right to where I wanted to be. I believe there is a... I could try it. I don't know, would that be that easy though? I think you need a key, unless I can break the lock somehow. No. Yeah, it's not giving me the option to use it. Okay, let's just do a quick sweep over the plant. So, mixing vats maybe of some sort? I wonder if this could be like a water treatment plant almost. If so, then that would kind of dissolve my idea on the chemistry stuff. 
That's a key card reader. I have a feeling that's the way out. Let's check the other side. Hello from the other side. Yeah, it's never that easy. Uh, it's a little dark. Let's, uh, a little bit of light here. I don't want to be surprised by our oily friend. This place. Can I open this? I cannot. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Same, similar diagrams to the other place. So, so it's cafeteria. This place is making me a little unsettled. This is reminding me a lot of Rekin's chapter. Rekin's chapter was really in something else. Ah. There it is. Uh. Oh no. No! No 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Go faster! What are you doing? Oh my god. Run! Run! No, no, duck! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> uh. <laughs> the doors wouldn't open. What was I supposed to do? Open the door. Open the door. Why? Okay, like, just no. Just no. Why did I? Why did? I, why was I so upset with coming down here? I don't know, dude. You're just uh. <laughs> you can see his face better now. Oh, wait a minute. Is that that simple? Oh my god, really? <laughs> oh my god. Are you serious? Let's 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 try it. Oh my god, really? Okay. Alright. I see what you got going on. <laughs> okay, I can't see a thing now. Oh, okay. Later works. <laughs> That's why there was the vent out in the hallway. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad I found it too. I didn't want that to become a new um, gas leak room. All right, let's put money on it that Lewis is still around. I don't know where to go this time. Okay, well we know what to do. Open the locker, get the key card. If he doesn't chase me, maybe I can read stuff, I don't know. That'd be kind of nice, because I'm still kind of piecing together what he is. Am I going to get stuck in here too? Like this guy just wants, really wants to snack on me. Oh, come on. Okay, 
All right, so we got clothes. ID. Lewis Taylor, Taylor operator. Water treatment plant. Okay, okay, water treatment plant. So I was right. There was a treatment plant I was in. So how does the chemistry mix into this then? Is the door still open? <laughs> Lewis? Yeah, I remember those. But you still see those. Uh, you know, check surroundings, right? Okay. <sighs> Please be the exit. I can't take much more of him. I already gotta deal with him in my own house. <laughs> it's my house, like, get out. <laughs> Yeah, okay, there's the well. So a water treatment plant. That's the oil part I can't really figure out with that. I honestly don't remember this part. Like, I don't remember what to do exactly. It might just do it for you. There's the well. The apple. Why is there an apple? That's gotta have some significance. One apple to boot. And I know there's more to this place. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> now the water. Or whatever that is. Those are the wretched souls. So when we're back. Oh, the the water heater in the basement. There's the piece. <laughs> yeah, I know game. I'm gonna die picking this up. That'd be the cherry on top. Alright, watch the game. I'll find a candle here somewhere. After that. <laughs> yeah. This room. Oh, come on. Alright, I'm gonna need more can can er, candles. I don't have any candles. I'm gonna need more lighters. There's no way 
I'm gonna survive breaking this chapter later if I don't have more. Yeah, I know. Don't need to be that way. Okay. Alright. Oh, God, come on. Alright, so here's the question then. Do we want to mess with the last one? Uh, I'm gonna hope that was just a quick glitch. Alright. Yeah, it's, uh, let's watch it at least, and we don't need to do it. I already watched it. We thought it was Dolores that was blocking us from it, because of the chain door. So, we can always cut it off here, so, I mean, we've been going for like four hours now. I thought that was the basement. I thought that was actually the negligence one. So, I was wrong about that. Location might be the same, but... That's the lighthouse. I know where that's at. I have no idea what that is. If that's like... Okay, there's, there's the basement again. Same area. Bedroom my bedroom not sure on that one I don't know so they're going too fast I can't tell the rooms apart uh, I almost need to take stills of those and kinda compare them so I'm not sure I I'm just gonna leave it in anyway it's not like we can play with it later if we want to So, I don't know, um, we can call it there if you guys want. I really can't think of where that would be. I mean, I know the basement part. I know what, what that's pointing to. I think this is the wall. And the freezers here so something in this area is one of them oh you know I completely forgot about the alien in this game there's an alien in here you can find he's a lot of times he appears here just running around behind the photos. Can I put this down? I don't really want it. Can I play it? Oh my god, really? Just plays the song over? can't interact with the photos the freezer room coffee salts nothing really suspicious here well They showed a lot of rooms. That's just one I one I, area I'm familiar with.
So, um, I don't know. I guess we can call it there if you guys, if, uh, Firebird, if you want to go to bed. I'm sure Sacred is probably tired too. I'm tired. <laughs> uh, we established last time that this was the closet we were looking at. But that's as far as I got. I cannot identify the other rooms. Uh, picture. Oh. 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 It's the picture frames. The picture frames in the image. It's telling us where to find them. Okay. Okay. Well, I figured it out. <laughs> I thought that thing looked weird. I thought that looked... Oh, now I'm curious. Okay, I want to check the basement one more time. I, I have a feeling I was right on top of... Either I'm right on top of one, or that's where you put them like they were in the video. That's it. Progress room. Okay. Oh, I know exactly where that is. No, 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 no. Where is that? Bad. Progress room. And there's three of them. Okay, I don't need this room anymore. That's right, We you identified the progress room last time. I'm, I'm just curious now. I don't think the lighthouse is... I don't remember if that's a short section or not, so we don't have to do it. I just want to... I just want to see where the photos are. Frames are. The frames. There it is. Okay. The other one, I'm not sure on. That was it. Okay. Mystery solved. And that's going to bring me to the lighthouse area. Which I think we run into the plague mask guy again. Um, I'm just gonna watch this one more time. I want to see those again. Then we can cut it. So none of the Dolores stuff should have blocked us from this so far. Then. There's four picture, four or five picture frames. Jeez. Five? Did they show us five different parts of the house? I bet. I don't know if that's part of the house. What was going on? Got that one. That's, you got that one. There's tires, that's gotta be the garage. That's the basement, I think. Maybe? I'm curious. I don't want to initiate the section, but I'm curious if I know where those are. This area looks a little... I could be way off on it, but... I think one was the garage. Oh, no. Okay. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> Lewis, why you do this, baby? Oh, oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. He's gaining. The lights did. Come on, Lewis. Let's be. Let's, uh. Why, why are you in my house? Oh. Oh. Oh, man. Why are the lights still flickering? Why are the lights still flickering? Why are the lights still flickering? Stop. 
please stop. Uh, I don't like this. This bothers me. Um, that's up here. Okay, I do not like that. Oh, that. I, I want to say this was the area. Somewhere down here. I could be way off. It's, why are you flickering? Stop. Okay, so, um. Why don't we pick it up next time? <laughs> That's a good place to leave it off. That's enough. I think it's enough scare for one night. I... Why am I still looking? I'm, I'm going upstairs. I'm done. I'm done. We're calling it. Let's go save in front of the TV. Would you? No. Uh uh. No. I had enough of you. Okay.